What's going on, guys? It's Jake back at it again. Um, sorry it's a little dark in here. I don't really have good lighting in here, and I never do. So, something I'm just kind of used to, um, but I can tell it's kind of dark. So, I'm trying to bring some more light. Does that work? Oh, man, I need a New Jersey. Look at You can tell how much weight I've lost. I can pull this, like... All the way out. Example of losing 150 pounds. I should be wearing a large, even though I'm wearing like a 3X jersey. It's ridiculous. Makes me look extra big, but whatever. It's all baggy. It's hot today. I really don't care. Um. So the reason I'm making this video is because um, since I'm doing the channeling, things are just coming. Um, and I'm really starting to learn because I'm brand new to this and learning, you know, don't overdo it. Um, if there's no messages coming, you know, just don't, don't push it because you don't want to, you don't want to push it. You don't want to force, you know, things, especially something positive. You don't want to force it. You don't want to make it bad. Um, so what I'm doing, what I'm going to do is when something comes to me or when some, or being whatever, you know, comes to me. I'm just gonna try to get the video and connect, you know, you know what I'm saying, like in that moment, like use that opportunity. Um, and all day yesterday, and then all day today, um, I've just been having this energy around me that's really, really strong. Um, part of it too is that the last couple of days there's just been, there's this, um, reptilian being that's been around basically. And I, I think he just wants to be channeled. Um, it's coming very positively it's just you know you gotta be careful you gotta be careful with that stuff um can't trust everything you know so i'm gonna see if this dude has a message um and i know he's here so i'm gonna see if i can channel him if not just conscious channel or whatever so uh we're gonna see how this goes so i didn't even get myself ready yet so god thank you um please give me this opportunity angels please connect me to the white light Keep me safe. Keep me, keep me grounded with Gaia, please. No negative energies. Um, and by the way, guys, I do this, you know, obviously every time before I channel. It's just, this is like a, a spontaneous video. I wasn't planning on making a video, so bear with me. Sorry, guys. Uh, please keep me in the white light. Please, Raphael, Uriel, and any other angels that I know that are always around you, please be around me. Um, Mary, I know you've been around a lot lately. Please surround me with your unconditional love. And if there's any positive beings that are here to support me, um, and always God, Yeshua, please connect and make sure that the message can come out as clear as possible. Without me interfering, thank you. So, I guess, let's see how this goes.
Greetings, everybody. Still getting these connections in. He's not really working with me. But that's okay. So this is my grand introduction. Hello, everybody. I've been around this one for a couple days now, but his demeanor hasn't really been positive every time I have tried to give him an image of me to show him that I wanted to connect, that there is a meaning behind this, and that I am positive. My look is very intimidating to some of you guys, but to me, I look pretty cool. A lot of other reptilians give me good compliments. I like to be called Ralph the Reptilian. Many of you guys always like names, and so I thought, what better way, Ralph the Reptilian? This is a hard connection. These bodies are so fragile. This won't be long. My job is different than many of the others. I am a historian. I am one that's for the people. I see the good side to you people. Oh, you guys are so hilarious, but you give me much joy. For much of the lightness that is within yourself that you don't see, you, you have much more than other things, and it is fascinating. Hilarious at the same time. You guys give a good reason to laugh, but also to be entertained and to be patient with humanity. Like I said, I'm a historian. You can call me a librarian of times, of your times. I am kind of like an advisor to your world in terms of things that you may not understand, so let's keep it as a historian, kind of like a librarian. I keep documents of information that is important, that can be handled with care from certain individuals, and I keep things at a balance. The other reptilians, I call them schmucks, the other reptilians, don't really give me a good time, but I am much different. I am reserved in my actions. I like to bring forth the light, which can be difficult, and because of that, I am looked at as an outsider or an outcast, but who really gives a shit if you're working for the white light? Who cares? If you're doing the greater good, they can suck it. And if any of you ever have any negative problems with any reptilians, just know that you just let them know you are not afraid. And to go on their business and make a bug off. They have many other places they can go. They choose to mess with you because it is entertaining and it is fun. My message here is pretty short. This is very hard. I kept telling him that I am very funny. I am outgoing. I like to laugh a whole lot. My laugh might scare you, but I like to laugh a lot. But. I showed my presence to Jake a couple days ago, and he was kind of intimidating. Intimidated. In your human measurements, I'm probably anywhere from 8 to 9 feet, bald, beautiful scales, beautiful designs, and I have a long, great green, dark green tail. I looked at my eyes as beautiful, but you may look at my eyes as intimidating. Even though I work for the positive light, and I try to reach as far as I can go, there are many limitations being in this form, but there are many advantages. And many humans that I have actually spoken to have said that they wish that they had our beauty. But that is the only commonality I share with many others. 
like I said, I, I understand you. I am for your people. You can call on me to bring help and to bring laughter and guidance, and I will. Oh, I have a whole book of tricks that I am just waiting to let you know. So you can know how awesome we are. And you can explore. For your world has been in a system of shackling through the reptilian mind agenda. That's why you have the reptilian mind. But I do not like to say fight fire with fire, but what better way to get out of their grasp than to join the positive beings that they are connected to, that they wish not to let know. It is true we hold much great power. And with that great power comes much learning. But know that you can call upon this learning and then you have this learning. And all I ask is that you bring forth this ability within yourselves. For when the people are empowered, there is no control from a negative standpoint. Yes, I see in the future much workings and collaboration with you, people, with the human race. But that is not for now. He is getting uncomfortable, so I'm going to go. I will be around. <laughs> I will always be around. But know that my light, light is always there. And I do not want to let too much out, for I just want a good impression on your peoples for now. Thank you. We must go. These limitations are challenging, but so mesmerizing that you are able to be in these and be content. I want to get out of here. Blessings. This is Ralph. Good day. Oh, man. Oh, that was weird. That felt cool. That was weird. I'm going to have to get used to that. <laughs> For sure. Wow. <sighs> Alright, guys. Well, thank you, sir. Thank you, guys. Um... I'm gonna rewatch this one. This is that that that's gotta be interesting. I just have a whole bunch of weird feelings right now. So I'm gonna I'm gonna go see what that guy said. So thank you guys. Um I'll see you guys in another one. So alright. Glad I was able to hit this on the spot. Um when opportunity arose. So alright guys, talk to you later.